Hi, welcome to Ebony and Ivory Motors. My name is Rick, just here today to show you this Skoda. It's the Octavia TDI VRS 2 litre. A manual transmission on a 1616 covering just over 72,000 miles. Does come complete with two keys, original book pack and locking wheel nut. Only two owners from new, finished off in grey metallic with full documented service history, last done on the 4th of January just this year. Uh, MOT is also uh, done at the same similar time, so that's not due until the 14th of January 2025. We'll still go for our workshop for a mechanical checkover. Has just come in to us, so I've been washed off for photo and video purposes. And what I'm going to do first of all, I'm going to walk you around the car nice and quick. On the second time round, we'll get into a little bit more detail of the car itself. Has just been washed off for photo and video purposes. We ourselves are a Volkswagen Audi specialist. Uh, we do use these videos to help us prepare our cars from so they are brutally honest. When we get back down to the front, we're gonna look at the panel work one by one. We'll start at the near side arch, work our way down the vehicle, and we're looking for any dents, chips, scrapes, and scratches, etc. cetera. Um, well, what we'll do is we'll point them out and what we're gonna to do to them before sale. So, over the front arch, looks to be in good condition. Front door also looks good as does the rear door from this angle, as does that rear arch. The front alloy wheel is slightly curved on the outside outer edge. I have a quick look to all the wheels on the vehicle and they've all got some light curbing. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna refinish the wheels in uh, a solid gray color throughout. The front tire is a Bridgestone tire. Uh, so high end tire with approximately five, six millimeters of tread remaining. Working our way down the vehicle, a lot of light marks that just want buffing and flattening and polishing but nothing major and a couple just on this back wing but no, again nothing major let's see the wheels it's a shame because they are in good condition but we'll get them all finished off in grey uh, another higher Michelin tyre and the rear approximately four to five millimetres of tread remaining just working our way back down the vehicle just to make sure I've not missed anything but in fairness other than the wheels which we're going to get redone that near side looks good. So moving around the rear of the car now, you'll notice it has got the rear sensors and it's got the twin pipes, as you can see. Generally speaking, the rear bumper is in really good condition. There's a little bit of flat and polishing to do just there, only light superficial, no damage, etc. The rest of the bumper in excellent condition. Moving up to the tailgates and lights. Tailgate and lights, in fairness, are pretty much unmarked. And along that top, the spoiler that's just a spider by the way i'm not going to touch that They're all looking good rear screen is good on along that roof as you can see there's no damage there so we'll go back down the driver's side now we're going to go from the back to the front so over that quarter and arch look good rear door also looks good as does the front door and from this angle as does the front wing I'm going to keep showing you the wheels. As you can see, they're not major damage, but again, we'll refinish them in grey. Another higher Michelin tyre, uh, approximately four to five millimetres of tread remaining. And then moving down to the front, another high end tyre, this one on a Bridgestone, and again, about four to five millimetres. So all the tyres, high end tyres, all good tre tread left, and all the wheels were refinished to the grey. Uh, just make sure we've not missed anything. We were looking really good so far. So moving around the front of the vehicle, lights, grills, etc. The driver's light is good. Bumper corner, couple of chips just at the bottom, as you'd expect from the age of mileage, and just a slight pepper around there on that bottom too. And nothing more than you'd expect. Fog light and lower surround, all good condition, no damage, and that fog light and surround is good. Bumper corner again, good. So light is good and no damage to number plate or main grill. Just moving down for the line of the bonnet. Bonnet looks to be in excellent condition. A couple of very small chips, which will touch in with a genuine Skoda touch up pen, but generally really good condition. Moving up to the windscreen, just to see if there's anything here, chips to note on there. But as you can see, looking in excellent condition. So what I'm gonna do is I'll show you inside the car now. We'll start in the boot. 
So boot is in excellent condition. All carpets, passage off in place. And then just moving into the back. So rear bench seat in good condition, no rips, no tear. Three three-point belts, three headrests, two outer seats are isofix or isofix and the rear carpets again looking good door card is in good condition electric windows electric mirror switches there driver's seat holding all its bolsters etc again no rips no tears passenger seat again if better than the driver's seat um, just checking out them carpets so no rips to the carpet either so just jumping into the vehicle now as you'll see it's on 72 892 if you missed it it's there first thing we will do is actually put some fuel in the vehicle so what i'm going to do is i'll just run you through the display as you see it's just turning on now okay so it's FM radio as well as a digital radio. It does come with the Bluetooth technology. Also satellite navigation. And you obviously get the display for the rear sensors which are on the vehicle from the factory. Dual clamp control, logs, USB points are there. Traction control, VRS mode, etc. All the switches and buttons in excellent condition, cup holders, gear stick, armrest, all fully working. Does have cruise control, multifunctional steering wheel, it's a nice flat bottom one as well. And then you do have the lane assist on this car. I think I've already shown you the electric windows and mirror switches, again in good condition. Automatic lights and wipers. Um, does have the upgraded sound system as well. And I think that probably covers everything off. Um, if you'd like some further information on the vehicle, please give us a call at Ebony Ivory. Just ask for the sales department and we'll look after you as best we can. Thank you very much. And